let's make it a good day. Just over a month ago, our next guest was in this very studio, sitting right there, talking about her new game show. Today, Person, Place, or Thing, hosted by my friend Melissa Peterman, premieres. Look. I kind of just want to guess. Do it. Um, is it a heart fibrillator? That's a good guess. <laughs> it is not a heart fibrillator. Is that even the right? Well, I think it's a defibrillator, <laughs> but you know what? Sometimes you want to be fibrillated. <laughs> I have wanted to be fibrillated for quite some time now. Um. That's right. You can see the show right here locally on Fox 9 Plus in Minnesota. And for our Seattle friends, Fox 13 in Seattle. Audience, give it up for our very own Melissa Peterman. Hello, Jason. Happy belated birthday. Thank you, love. Okay. Um, do you want me to yell at you at the beginning of the interview or the uh, end of the interview? You decide. Oh, I usually prefer it throughout the entire interview, but um, let's start the yelling off. Let's start with the yelling. Okay. Um, Melissa, remember when you were here a month ago? Just remember back. Remember that? I do, like it was yesterday. Okay. Um, remember when you got off the set and about four minutes later, news broke that um, you were reuniting with Reba? Remember that? Wait, news broke that I was reunited. Oh, did it? Yeah. And, and remember how you didn't break that here on our show? To be clear, nobody tells me anything. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then... Melissa, moment. Melissa, um, yes. and then remember two minutes after that, news broke that you were doing a movie with Reba? Remember that? Um, Jason, I don't, I had been drinking that morning and I don't, I don't remember a lot about that interview. I remember you looked really handsome and I remember I was just like looking at your eyes and yeah. um, oh, Look at those hats, hats. We need to wear more hats. Look at that. <laughs> well, okay, and, I'll, ask you, I'll ask you about that in a minute, but before okay. the Fox people have a heart attack that I haven't gotten into the game in two minutes, um, tell the folks, Melissa, what the concept is for this game. Uh, the game is person, place, or thing, which as you know, is a noun, but we, we did not want to name the show noun. Yeah. Um, <laughs> So it's, a, it's basically, it's a fun spin on 20 questions. Like we give our contestants a category, a person, place, or thing. They can ask me yes or no questions. Um, they can guess at any time. And then after everyone has a turn, I give them a clue. And it's so much fun. It feels familiar, yet we've got a nice spin on it. We do a speed round where I just give clues and they can ring in and we try to get as many as we can in two minutes. It's funny, We, I mean, clearly, I mean, again, what I love about it, as you know, because you're such an amazing host is, if you are just there, the, the contestants or whoever you're interviewing, they will shine. And I can't script stuff like Fibulator, like, yeah. you know, like that's the greatest gift of like Fibulator. Wouldn't Ever. that be great to have a Fibulator? You've been, ha <laughs> ha, I'm not touching that, Melissa. I'm not touching that. Would you, obviously you've been such a great participant on Meredith's the show, Meredith's show. Are you, I know what your answer is going to be. Are you having the best time ever being the host now? Because I think this is perfect for you. I'm having the best time. And I have to tell you that um, Meredith was so sweet. She sent me this a beautiful thing of flowers uh, after she knew we had finished taping the episodes and, and you know, wish me luck. And the thing is, if I could be like as one tenth as good as Meredith or or you or any of these hosts that I look up to, oh, I, I'll be very happy. But I love it. And and you know, the secret is that even though you're the host, it's not about you. No, it's it, the contestants. It's about them, and it's making sure that they shine and that they have fun and that they walk away 
feeling great. And, you know, this is, they're going to show these clips, you know, at every holiday, like they're family. So you want it to be amazing for them. Um, really quick, two things. Number one, Melissa and I share a big boss. His name is Stephen Brown. Stephen yes. Brown gave you all the money. Look at that set. That set is really beautiful. I'm telling you, I almost had a little panic attack when I walked in for the first day of rehearsal. I'm like, oh gosh. Yeah. They really, they really believe in me. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? Um, because the set was so beautiful. It's got this throwback to like um, this fun, like vintage, nostalgic, like 60s, 70s vibe. And, and Steven has been so behind the show. And yeah, I had that it's... little moment of like, oh my gosh, this is, I get to work here and they're, they actually, are, they think I can do it. No, you can't you know? do it. We got to go, but just really quick, is there any news that's going to break after we get done with this interview? <laughs> Yes, immediately following this interview, it's going to break that Melissa took her spanks off and put sweatpants on. <laughs> this is way too early. Why am I wearing spanks on a Zoom? Nobody can see. Yeah, are you wearing pants actually? I actually am wearing pants because I'm a professional, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Bye, sweetie. I'll be watching tonight. I love tonight. you too. I love you, Minnesota. Everybody, you. watch this show. Person, place, or thing starts today. It airs at 4 on Fox 9 Plus in Minnesota. And as I said, if you're watching in our friends in Seattle, Fox 13 at 11.30 p.m. We'll be right back. Back in a moment. Love her, love her, love her. Watch that show, everyone.